What a heated lineup of events happening, right? Just a couple of days ago, we got to check out Team Red's brand new lineup of CPUs. Now, Team Blue is back for the win. Yup, you heard that, right? Today in the house, as you can see, we have the brand new Intel 13th Gen Raptor Lake CPUs in the house. And we'll be unboxing and talking about everything you need to know about these CPUs, like the architecture, how much performance gains are there, and basically what you can expect over here. And not only that, Intel HQ has actually sent like a special media kit over here, guys, which includes the brand new CPUs along with a brand new Z790 motherboard from ROG. So you'll get to see all of these in this video. So let me quickly tell you like what's exactly new on the Intel's 13th gen Raptor Lake platform. First of all guys, 13th gen Raptor Lake is based on Intel 7 process which is still their 10 nanometer enhanced super fin process only but like a plus 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 variant of that. It's still based on the similar performance hybrid architecture just like Alder Lake but now you can expect like faster performance cores, double the number of E cores and they've also massively improved the L2 catch sizes guys. So all of these you know sum up to like 15% improved single threaded performance and almost up to like 41% multi threaded performance gain. So sum up all this on the overall you can expect like 40% performance scaling. So this is what I'm talking about. I'm pretty hyped and excited to you know check out these brand new CPUs and without wasting any more time let's get started. Oh, so our brand new Intel 13th Gen Media Kit is in the house guys, comes in this sort of box packaging. And as you can see, along with the processors, we even have the brand new Z790 motherboard also. This is from ROG, their Maximus Hero Edition gaming motherboard. So we'll be checking out both of these products in this video. First, I'll keep the motherboard aside. I want, I want to unbox and show you this Media Kit from Intel guys. This is what I'm like really excited about. Look at the packaging, complete their signature blue finish and you've got the Intel logo everywhere and I can also see some micro architecture pictures over here. Let's quickly unbox and check out. Oh boy, look at that. Look at the whole design guys. Looks like this is the Raptor Lakes micro architecture layout. Very nice and opening it, there you go, our brand new 13th gen Intel processors are over here. Let me also unbox the left side and see what do we have on the inside. Okay, what is this? looks like some sort of art piece. So just like last year's Alder Lake, this time also Intel is giving us like an art piece with, you know, Raptor Lake's micro architecture on the inside. And at the back, you've got some details on Intel's 13th gen processors, like all the specs, details and stuff. We'll talk about all of that at a later part in the video. Beautiful art piece. Let me keep that aside. And now let me show you the actual thing that we've been waiting for, guys. The brand new 13th gen processors from Intel. We've got both i5 and i9 in the house. So first, let's Let's check out the i9. Look at the packaging. Very different, right? This is the media kit, guys. You don't get your hands on these sort of stuff. This is like exclusively made for press and media. So, you know, kind of limited edition stuff. Anyways, there you go, guys. Our very first hands-on on Intel's 13th gen i9 CPU, the 13900K. This is right now the world's fastest desktop processor with up to 5.8 gigahertz clock speeds out of the box, guys. You can even push it to like 6 gigahertz also. That is also possible. Keeping that aside, you've got the i5 as well, 13th gen i5. 13600K. So i5 is a 14 core CPU guys and i9 is a 24 core CPU. We'll be talking about all the specs and stuff in a moment. Moving on now let's check out the brand new motherboard from ROG. This is their Maximus Z790 Hero Gaming motherboard and Z790 we've already covered one of the motherboard last week only guys where we spoke like what's new with Z790 chipset like basically all the new features and stuff Intel has added. Today in the house we have the ROG edition very special gaming motherboard so we're gonna unbox and quickly check out this board as usual guys ROG goes very flashy with their black and red stuff love the packaging as well and taking this out there you go our brand new gaming motherboard the hero edition oh my god look at this thing absolutely beautiful right is that a display on the left and bottom Oh boy, that's a massive customizable display, I believe. I'm like pretty excited to build a brand new 13th gen PC with this setup, guys. We'll be using this brand new Maximus Hero motherboard as well as Intel's 13th gen i9 world's fastest gaming desktop processor right now. So yeah, hype is real, guys. Massive, massive improvements compared to the previous gen. 
So that was our quick unboxing and first exclusive hands-on Intel 13th gen Raptor Lake CPUs. I'm like pretty excited guys. I can't wait to build a system with this and see what sort of performance we're getting. But before we get there now, let me quickly like brush you people with the architecture and you know specs and details and all about that. So first of all, coming to the architecture, these brand new 13th gen Raptor Lake are still based on Intel 7 process only and come with a similar performance hybrid architecture just like the last gen. So you have both P cores and E cores, P stands for performance, E stands for efficiency cores and both of these work together and offer like incredible performance and gains across the stack. So keeping that aside guys, the Intel 7 process this time they've used is an upgraded enhanced version compared to the last gen. So this is like the brand's third generation of Intel Superfin transistor micro architecture right and offers like significantly better channel mobility. So there are definitely gains over here. See either it be based on 5 nanometer, 7 nanometer or 10 nanometer also. At the end of the day what you require is performance numbers right results if you are getting that then all of this doesn't matter for a regular consumer right so that is what you should be looking for you're definitely having like good amount of performance gains and also efficiency has been improved we'll talk about all of this anyhow in my performance benchmarks and review of the cpus right so till then you'll have to wait about that now keeping that aside, these brand new 13th gen CPUs offer like faster P cores compared to the last gen. So now look at the Intel i9 only 13900K, it offers like up to 5.8 GHz clock frequencies out of the box. And along with that you're also getting double the number of E cores. So if you look at 13900K right, it's got like 24 cores, 32 threads, out of that 8 are P cores and you're getting almost 16 E cores guys. So this is like massive and also if you look at the catch size right. That that has also been like greatly improved. So total L2 catch on the 13900K is now around 32 MB. So sum up all of these and you can expect like massive performance and you know efficiency gains across the stack. So compared to the previous gen there's almost like 15% improved single threaded performance gain over here and almost like 41% multi threaded performance gain. So this is what again Intel is saying we'll have to practically build a PC and you know test it out in real world applications. You guys let me know like what sort of benchmarks or you know what sort of stress test do you want me to do with these brand new CPUs and I'll definitely do that. Best part is Intel India actually invited all the media and tech reviewers to their 13th gen Raptor Lake launch event held in Delhi just yesterday. It was a pretty fun trip. We got to speak to the Intel team over there. They actually gave a lot of presentations and briefing sessions about the brand new 13th gen CPUs. We spoke about the architecture, new technologies introduced and we also got to check out some amazing gaming PC builds part by 13th gen CPUs all i5, i7 and i9 as well. It was a pretty fun trip on the overall. Intel has also shared us some benchmarks, you know, and comparisons with the last gen as well as the competition. So if you compare it with Intel's 12th gen Arler Lake CPUs, the brand new 13th gen offer up to like 24% better gaming performance. And if you look at the content creation side, there's almost like 34% faster creator workflow. So there's definitely like a huge improvement over here. And now if you look at the competition side, if you compare 13th gen i9 versus Ryzen 9 7950X, here you're almost seeing up to like 13 to 14 percent improved gaming performance now that was a bit of surprise and also on the content creation side as well intel is giving like a tough competition to team red so some of the applications you're getting to see almost like on par performance like you know adobe apps but if you look at the other applications like maybe autocad and you know these sort of stuff there you're getting almost like four to five percent better performance on team blue's side so as i've told you these benchmarks and numbers have been shared by the brand but we'll have to practically see we'll have to build a pc and see what sort of numbers and results we will be getting in real world so this is something i'll be doing very soon guys so stay tuned to the channel for the full review on these cpus so yeah for the pc i'm thinking of going all out we'll be building like the most powerful gaming pc build using intel's 13th gen i9 13900k and pair it with this brand new z790 motherboard from rog and maybe use like you know rtx 4090 that's sitting right over there right so we'll be building like a very powerful gaming pc system on the channel and you know we'll do variety of tests let me know what sort of games or you know benchmarks you want me to include in that video and i'll definitely do that and do you want me to focus on some creator related applications as well share your thoughts in the comment section down below so that is pretty much it for today time to wrap it up stay tuned for my next video guys it's gonna be awesome and make sure to smash that like button on this video and subscribe to my channel for more such awesome videos and i'll see you all in my next one